The garden route in South Africa is packed with once in a lifetime experiences. From game drives, to climbing through caves, to surf lessons, to elephants. You just couldn't ask for a better way to experience South Africa. This is an opportunity to travel through some of the most beautiful landscapes in South Africa, having a great adventure and meeting new people. Your journey starts with a five hour trip along the coast to Wilderness National Park. We're gonna take to the water on a two hour canoe ride with a professional guide. <laughs> this tour really made my trip to South Africa something special. I had such an amazing time. Even from the first day, like the canoeing was absolutely amazing. And then it just got better and better. Then it's a 30 minute drive to your hotel for the night. Take the evening to rest and enjoy the ambiance of the South African coast. It's day two. Today is going to be full of adventure, but we've made our first stop just to take in the beautiful views. <gasps> so far, the garden route does not disappoint. Next stop on the tour, the world's highest bridge bungee jump. I'm with Tony. He's been on our tour. He's brave enough to actually jump off the bridge. How do you feel? Yeah, I'm starting to get a little bit nervous now that we're actually here. <laughs> If you're going to bungee jump, this is the place to do it because it's one of the highest jumps in the world and you get some major bragging rights. We've just arrived at our next stop, Sitsikama National Park, where you can take a dip in the sea and even take a hike to the suspension bridge. Today is non-stop adventure. We're at our next stop, zip lining. All right, here goes. After zip lining, drive to world famous surfing spot Jeffrey's Bay for the night. It's day three and I'm really excited. We're about to tour Addo Elephant National Park, which is home to the largest population of elephants in the world. There's a whole family and they are absolutely beautiful. I'm choosing to take a surf lesson in one of the world's most famous surf spots. You did it! Day four, we've just arrived at our first stop, an ostrich farm. So if you want, you actually get a chance to feed the ostriches. <laughs> For our next stop, we're gonna tour the Kango Caves. Located in a limestone ridge, the Kango Caves have over two and a half miles of dripstone caverns. Good morning, it's a new day. We're off to our next activity. We're doing a meet and greet with three gorgeous elephants. Hi! You're so sweet. Oh, I love you too. Oh. <laughs> this might be the best day of my life. These rangers are like family to the elephants. They've raised them since they were babies for the last 16 years. They are so well loved and cared for. The elephants are just so affectionate. We're headed back to the bush for a game drive where we're hoping to see rhinos, hippos, antelope, and maybe giraffe. We are probably 20 feet from this giraffe. We're so close. The garden route in South Africa is the road trip of a lifetime. 